I'm just showing you details about the emulsion tube. This is the tip of the emulsion tube. So if you look the copper part right here, it's about 2-3 two, three, three, two, three millimeter tall. It's really the tip. You see perhaps there is like a, a circle here. It's right at the bottom in the middle of that circle. I'm going to just point with a tiny wire. And so is is this guy right here actually you can even insert the wire into it into the tube it has an opening at the top and now this tube here i think hopefully you get a really a good a good image of it you do have a small screw underneath and that screw has uh, takes a, a flat screwdriver but unfortunately the slot of the screw is really slim so this is the only uh, screwdriver it's actually from a smaller screwdriver is the tip the only one that fits in there I, I will give the dimensions here the width it's four millimeters you cannot put more than four or perhaps five but especially the width the thickness of the uh, flat uh, tip it's no more than one millimeter you cannot put a thicker one it's not going to grab the slot into the screw and the screw sits underneath here you need to kind of push upwards and just make sure you center it center the tip in the hole and just try to grab the slot of that screw and screw it and make sure you don't drop it on the on the uh, on the floor because you are going to lose it now i want to warn you something when you put it back in place I do have another video where I show how these two parts sits, the tube and the screw, but when you put it back in place, I did had a lot of problem getting the tube to lift like it does here. I did, when you push it in there, the tube first, and you uh, push the screw after the tube, the tube uh, most often times will just uh, come flush like where you see the tip of my screwdriver will just come very flush with the bottom here but will not lift this last two or three millimeters i did have a lot of trouble trouble actually centering the tube into the hole to have it lift this last two three millimeters that you see here uh, i cannot help with this it's just really try to screw this thing in don't force on it because it's copper is very soft metal so you deform it uh, but try to screw it in uh, and uh, uh, at some point hopefully you will see the tip coming out if you don't see the tip coming out it's not good the screw will not be screwed all the way and tight in there so the tube may just kind of drop, drop back on there is the screw that keeps the bolt that goes in there so you won't lose them but the motion tube will not sit properly perhaps it's not going to spray properly the gasoline so uh, carefully this and again you don't have to force on it i really just tighten it with fingers don't force on it because it's copper it's soft you you just deform that screw and uh, you will have uh, you you will have problems uh, later on okay so careful with this detail notice the choke is full open i did lift the choke no it's full open that's the tip of the emulsion tube right there 